guys what's up so this just came in from China and uh, this is a heater replacement for that uh, ultrasonic cleaner hopefully this doesn't have the coronavirus on it <laughs> there we go with all the stuff coming from China alright so it's obviously it looks a little bit different than the original one but I gotta take it all apart again and I also got some uh, 110 volt 100 watt and I also got some uh, thermal uh, thermal glue. So I'm gonna take this back apart again and uh, see if I can get this thing going again. All right, so I'm gonna try to get this a uh, chisel in there. Let's see if it comes up. So I'm gonna get some more room. Yeah, the original one was like a ceramic material. I had to break it just to get it off there. So I'm going to go back and... Alright, so that's the thermal glue right there and the heater is in place. There's no instructions on this stuff so I have no clue on the uh, set time and what to do with it. So I'm going to open it up and we're just going to put a layer on the bottom here and then try to glue it in there. Alright. So I wanted to get a little bit around the lips, around the edge, to kind of help hold it in place. But, uh, yeah, like I said, I have no clue on how long it's going to take to dry. So, it feels kind of like it might be like a silicone type thermal glue, so. Alright, so I let the glue dry overnight here, and get this back together. This should go... like that. Okay. And these wires will go around like that. This stuff will go back in here. Okay. Kind of glad they put a lot of extra stuff in there. But it kind of keeps everything stable. My screwdriver. Find it. Okay, so now I have to cut and solder these in there, like that. So I'm going to cut those leads short, I'm going to cut these off here. Alright. I'm actually not going to use caps. I'm going to solder and, and shrink wrap. So I don't like to use caps if I don't have to. Alright, so I'm going to go back and solder these and shrink wrap them. Alright, there it is. So I'm going to put it back together and we'll fire it up. Let's see if we get some heat. Alright, so I have this thing plugged in. We're going to turn the temperature on. I have a couple of these uh, thermometers. So I just want to see if it actually works. But um, I wish I had to put this into temperature mode. It's like 64 degrees Fahrenheit. It's actually raining outside right now, but uh, I also have a fluke tester too, but this thing has always been kind of hard to pick up. Um, it, actually, I never really like this thing 100%. It just, it's not accurate. So about a 60 degrees probably. Somewhere in there. So I'm going to do a comparison. Um, okay, so let's get this thing going. See what happens. Hope it doesn't burn up. All right, we'll see if this thing heats up. And I'm going to keep an eye on it so it doesn't burn down. <laughs> you never know, the stuff's coming from China, man. It said, it said 110 volt, 100 watt, so I guess we'll see. Yeah, it, uh, what's funny is the uh, thermal paste actually costs more than the heater. So, all right. Well, this thing's definitely getting hot. I burnt my fingerprints in there. <laughs> I went down and touched it. But I'm a little nervous about keeping this on my bench. So... Yeah, unattended, so. Alright, so it's probably been about 15-20 minutes. And almost, looks like it's boiling right there with the heater. Let's uh, turn this on real fast. Get my little probe here. Tell me all this is going to be, can't see that, but it's. 104 degrees over there it's 
It's 113 degrees. All right, yeah, I mean, it's definitely working. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it go for a little bit longer and see what happens. All right, so I think this is a successful fix. Uh, there's actually an auto timer, um, auto off on the, on the heater. So it shut off a while ago when I was out here. And so we'll try this one more time and uh, call the fix. Actually, I'm wrong. It's obviously a lot harder on this side where the heater's at. That little, that little uh, rectangle is actually where the heater's at. Alright guys, cool. I think I got it fixed. Yeah, it's pretty hot.